Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to today's edition of the Justice Review. We like to take our favorite shows. They can be in the room of sci-fi, horror, you know, superhero. We don't care what it is, just as long as it's good content. If we like it, we love it. If we hate it, God damn it, you're going to hear about it today. Today, we ended the end of a chapter. That's right. One Division has come to its conclusion. And the Rocky... <laughs> It's an inevitable conclusion. <laughs> and the rocky, you know, acceptance of this show has been mass. But we got to talk about it. We're going to talk about the good things about this episode and the things that was like, why did you even do this? That happened. Yes, for yeah. some reasons. So Let's are, we, go. are we talking about theory? <laughs> <laughs> we will be bringing up theories as well, because I have several too, mm -hmm. that there will not be a season two. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go ahead and kick this pig. All right, let's talk about the goods. I'll go first. I like Wanda's outfit. Well, you know, fuck me. But <laughs> <laughs> I did like her outfit. I thought it, I liked the upgraded, customized Scarlet Witch outfit. It, it kind of reminded me of Helen's outfit. Mm -hmm. And I like that I was wrong and said that there would never be a mention of Scarlet Witch. And they said, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> We're going, we going full hog. It, it, was, it was badass. She looked hot in it. I mean, everything worked. I mean, for her. Her. <laughs> I like that. This was the worst theory in the Marvel <laughs> and, and we only have up to go from here. You think um, Falcon and Winter Soldier is going to be better? <laughs> yes. <laughs> you know I'm going to say it. Yes. Let's, let's, let's give Anthony, Anthony Mackie a chance to show what he can I, do. I, I saw Outside the Wire this weekend. I'm I, wanted sorry. Go, I wanted to go back in. I'm <laughs> sorry. It was Outside the Wire. Uh, Don't worry about it. An, an action movie. It doesn't exist. <laughs> <laughs> Just like leaving to the Wanda Vision. <laughs> another, good, uh, another good thing that I like. Um, wait, I got it. I actually like the confrontation between Vision and Vision. Uh, yeah, that, that was the better fight to me. Mm -hmm. uh, that whole uh, fight going between them and then the logical parameters that he ran yeah. to convert Vision. You know, it was actually spot on and I like the way that, that direction that that took. Uh, it was a way of resurrecting Vision without actually resurrecting Vision. Mm -hmm. Did you see? I like how White Vision mannerisms were. I don't mm -hmm. know if you noticed any of that. But almost like, to the point where I, I, I human. Yeah, yeah. but uh, and almost to the point where I kind of questioned if Paul Bettany was really playing him because he came off he that and that to me says that Paul Bettany has range like a motherfucker. Exactly, because I was like that. Well, I mean, we saw that throughout the series. When, I mean, if you know Paul Bettany's work, you know he got. If you've ever seen A Knight's Tale, you know he goes in. If you ever seen Da Vinci Code, if you ever seen Priest, you ever seen? Um, you ain't gonna beat me in this. <laughs> uh, it's not Fallen, but he was he was he was an archangel. Legion, Legion. Yeah, it was. It was Legion. Yes, because Paul Bettany is an amazing actor. He was also a vampire slayer. Sure, <laughs> and he was in Solo. Shut up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, so, and, and what we're trying to say is Paul Bettany has uh, showed a wide range of acting skills, especially throughout this series that we didn't know he had. Also, I give a little bit, Elizabeth also a little bit of that flavor too. But, you know, the, the acting in this was, uh, from all the way from start to conclusion, was actually spot on. What yeah. about you? Any goods? Um, Christian? <laughs> I just imagine my hand just connects <laughs> with your face. You want tape? That's what we call evidence. <laughs> You'll never get me alone. Right, um, my goods for this episode were mainly on Catherine Hahn because oh, yeah. I didn't really see her as the villain. I guess you could paint it that way because she, she wasn't. She as far as I was concerned. Let me finish. No. <laughs> That wasn't for you. No, <laughs> it was for them. <laughs> say, it, say it. This is the hill she wants to die on. No, okay. she said she said oh, she wasn't no, a villain. No, 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 whatever. Villain. Okay, good. Keep yeah. doing. Yeah, keep going. Yeah. We. So I, I, I didn't agree. See her as the vision because she sees Wanda, who doesn't know what she has, mm -hmm. and doesn't know how to use it. So she's just like, well. I've had centuries of experience and I actually know more about your power set than you do. Give it to me. Mm -hmm. Because you made your little small town utopia and you're not doing anything. So you have all this power I have a going question. to wait. I have a question for you. Wait, wait, for, wait. For specifically for you in regards to that. Okay. When Agatha Harkness declared all of that stuff, did she in any way threaten 
to do any harm or world domination or any of that stuff. Well, I don't think you're gonna like show all your hands. I don't know what her plans were. Well, 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 no, no, no. I can take one. I can take you further than that. But Agatha has had all this power all this time. Has she been fucking with anybody? Not that we've seen, but she's, I guess she's had the dark but, hole. But this is the first time that they've introduced her character to right. us. So mm -hmm. I'm saying they could have later, like shown what her plans were, because the way it looks is that she's coming back sooner when Wanda needs answers or something. She's gonna like snap her out of the trance, the mindset you that she's the enslavement. <laughs> Hold on, wait, wait, let's go, wait, wait, let's, let's get these goods out of the way. As far as I'm concerned, Agatha Harkness was the only Avenger that had the power. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, 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 yeah, with this episode, but I have. What are you talking about? That's classic White Vision. The Night King. You you seen the Night King from Game of Thrones? Yes. So he looks like the Night King. No. no. Have you ever seen Classic Vision? No. I'm saying he looks like the Night King. Okay. From Game of Thrones. So, <laughs> well, there was so a anyway. comic book in the 1980s called the West Coast Avengers, and he. The West Coast Avengers. Yes. Yeah. Some of the Avengers were like, and they were like California. <laughs> <laughs> All they did was bump NWA and say, fuck the police. <laughs> and Miss Vision wore that. <laughs> wore that outfit specifically. Mm -hmm. um, it's comic book accurate. So, when... Um, I'm trying to figure out who took who where. I think uh, Agnes... No. No. Wanda, Wanda took Agnes, Agnes to to her to her mind, her mind palace, her mind she jail. Did this shit. She, she did this <laughs> shit. She did that. Give it to the baby. No, um, why did she do that? Back in Jufu. <laughs> she did, so, so she did the jujitsu, but what she didn't realize was that you can't pull that on the tachi. And <laughs> you can't pull a jujitsu on the tachi when you Sasuke. <laughs> Breach. So she flipped it on her. Was like, yeah, nah, that that shit ain't gonna happen. <laughs> that's, that's not gonna fly. Okay, <laughs> okay. Suki, I'm yeah. I taught you this. <laughs> Question is, are we done with the good? Yeah, because my my hand is shaking. We're done with the good. We, yeah. Oh. oh. No, go ahead. I had um, Monica. I like that we got to see. <laughs> no, wait, wait, wait. I like that we got to see. See what? Her, 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 the <laughs> bullets go through her and see, you know, more of her powers. But I also have a bad with that exact same what, situation. What was that? It, what? Was, it was called shucking and jiving. <laughs> no, wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, no, no. I like that we get to see, you know, what more of what her powers can do. Mm. But I have a bad with that. Situation. Power wise, she converted into, and that's her ability, that's her main ability. Any energy ever on the spectrum, on the spectrum, she can turn into it, control it, all of that. As a matter of fact, her and the Hulk will be awesome because she can turn into Gamma. She is, she is so, she is really power. She is, she is, she can turn into light receptors. Yeah, they, they say she's one of the most powerful characters on Earth in the Marvel Universe. Okay. But that's the comics. And okay, and this one, ooh, ooh, we about to get there. All right, y'all, are we done with the goods? Done with the goods. All right, oh, now it's time to go to the Baby Show. I was in the exact same situation. No, 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 no. We'll get back to it later. All right, we about to get into those bads. Everybody, shut up. I just want to say something, and everybody can start off. Hayward did nothing wrong. For each bot, brother. Completely going to Hayward. I want you to uh, Thank stop you. your situation. Hold on, hold on. Let me get my scratch music ready. Rambo. <laughs> <laughs> so you said Monica Rambo. <laughs> anyway, I like that we got to see her power set. I just wish we <clears throat> wouldn't have seen it when she was jumping in front of. Imaginary children. <laughs> you are about to sacrifice your life for imaginary children. You can't step and fetch harder than that. <laughs> Diggle, Diggle would be 
pleasantly surprised. Like, <laughs> he would be, be impressed. Like, <laughs> he would be impressed and jealous at the fact. <laughs> oh my! Like that part, I was like, oh my god, the magical black Negro. This is the definition of it. It was and like I warned you about that shit. I warned y'all about that shit episode ago. So Monica Rambeau, I'm glad you you know came into your powers, but to use them like that. Whatever, throw you, you, I gotta throw you in the trash now. Another thing I gotta bring up, Darcy, you on the jail. Darcy is going to jail. She hit a federal agent. Who was going to prison anyway? No, what, no, 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 for what? <laughs> so I, I got a question about that. Um, Hayward was put in cuff and fit the jail. What are what charges are they bringing him up on? Um, he falsified evidence. Oh, he led an unsanctioned attack. To who? To the team. And His so own team. team. Well, he's that he is in charge of. Listen to me, obviously. He was at the head of the chain. He was at the head of the chain. He would not have, you know, had to do all of that. He would have like, okay, so this is what happened. We're going in. But the fact that he had to do that means that he had to get clearance. What did he falsify? The evidence that oh, won the, the, the attack and stole the vision. What vision? There's only one vision. But the vision that was in there that everyone else saw, they, he said that she stole the body. Okay, where's the body? He has it! Who the has white it? vision that he had! The, no, everybody, the higher ups only know about one vision. They know, no, because they saw the, the vision that they brought in the episode. Don't look at me like that. <laughs> no, because he said this to Jimmy Woo. He said that you're, you're going to be in trouble when they see that there's two visions. He said when I'm done, there's only going to be one. How many visions? When are he's done indicating that he was going to kill the red vision, but obviously. You mean the, every, imagine, you mean the imaginary vision? But everybody saw him still, that he was still there, and that she had not stole the body. No, I'm going to tell you what's going to happen, and he's going to get off. Because he's a white man. <laughs> well, that too, but. So, that vision died, and the white vision disappeared. Not to mention, the only other people that saw those, vi those two visions were prisoners of Wanda's concentration camp. You don't think but they she don't... already let them out when they saw the body. Don't vision. fucking matter. <laughs> you don't think you they gonna be... out and they went you... under my control. If I'm the black dude in there, I'm gonna be like, there was no other vision. That bitch kept me in a cage. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to do that. I think the most... Be because he, fuck Wanda. He, even Wanda emphasized at the end, which, by the way, this is my bad. They'll never understand me. Look at how they look at me. And then Monica was like, <laughs> they, don't, they, don't know how, they don't know how much you, you sacrificed. Sacrifice. You just sacrificed nothing. So they already set the precedent that those people would probably side with Hayward because all On they top of that, they also it. saw Wanda and her imaginary groin spawn <laughs> attack the military. Oh, it gets worse than that. So, so, no, let me say this. All they see is a, a high-ranking military come in to try to save them after not after one of the Avengers No, because when they came in, week. she had already told them all to leave. No, no, but, it, but it's too late by then. Okay. You just held you, me you, prisoner. Yeah, you okay. just, you just taught, like, why would I, why would I, I'm happy because you let me go now, and the only reason you're letting me go now is okay. because shit's hitting the fan. Well, well, time no, that, listen, because well, you guys are saying, why would they side with her? I'm not seeing it that way. I'm seeing as, like, in a debrief, what, they're going to ask them what they saw, and they're like, well, we saw two of them. So it's not like to like, oh, you know, I'm jumping to Wanda's defense or, oh, the military came to help us, so I'm going to help them. It's what they saw. You, you're so, in a so, world where so, you don't know what's real or not, so they can be like... And, and Wanda... But when they think they now have clarity. And that's the thing, if they remember what happened. Because remember, when they was waking them up, he didn't know what was going on. He was like, i just been stuck inside this. Yeah, oh. They've been stuck inside it, but they remembered bits and pieces, but they had no control over themselves. My so now when they believe they have control and they believe they have clarity that they're awake now, they're going to say, what do you remember? This is what I remember. So my question is, debrief to who? The military that came in? The FBI? To ask sword. them what FBI happened? outranked sword? And that was another question. No, Who outranked people? who? Because, well, because, because... People! The <laughs> and, 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 and this isn't... This, we aren't attacking you. We're attacking the structure of the show. Okay. Because remember earlier, um, Haywood had Jimmy in cuffs. Mm -hmm. So unless they just bolt into some weird bondage, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> who is over who? Hold up. I, I, I just think there's separate divisions 
So I don't know. I like, is the FBI and the CIA like on and, par? And because even, they have different territories. And even Jimmy had to say, "All right, guys, go find evidence." Okay, I gotta. And say, that translates to let's sprinkle some crack in <laughs> so that we can at least get them on drug charges okay. because they got nothing. Oh no! Wait, 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 wait! I gotta point this. I gotta get this out. This is going back to the whole Wanda freeing them bullshit. First of all, I had well, another piece of battery I give is this bullshit amnesia thing. She, we clearly saw her wake her ass up. Go out clairvoyant as hell, clear head. Y'all need to stay out of this town. This is my town. Y'all need to leave the fuck alone. Blah, 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 blah. We saw that several times in this show. And now she want to pretend that she didn't keep these people held up. But I was protecting them. I was doing it for their benefit. Protecting them from what? The way the show made it look was that she was letting them lead happy lives. That, when that lady, against their will. When, when that yes, lady, it was against suggested, their will. She, 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 she subject, subjected them to stimuli that they would not otherwise subject themselves to I'm not just normally. That. The, the one that got me was the lady was like, hey, I'll do whatever you want. Just let my nine-year-old daughter out of her fucking room. And when, when Christian was to point out earlier, <laughs> her daughter's probably dead because she's been stuck in that room for a week. Two weeks. There are people that probably had sex with other people that they probably wouldn't have ever hooked up with, so that's pounds of rape. <laughs> there are dead people because where is the beekeeper? Not, there's there's trauma because they 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 have her nightmares. There, oh yeah, there's a lady. <laughs> in there addition were, to their own. There were people literally stuck in place, unable to move because of her. Like the lady putting up the clothesline who was crying because she was stuck outside for God knows how long. And the part, and that's what pisses me off. And she gets to walk away from this clean? Monica didn't even attempt to stop her. And not only that, they just threw away the whole mental health and mental instability thing that they was, because uh, action scene, because that they was harping on from the beginning. Like she didn't say, "Hey, you want to go and depression." And yeah. No, I think the way they made it look is that this was her dealing with her grief and then getting over. Her, it. Okay, but every her time you deal with it, you fuck people up. So I need you to go talk to a therapist, and not one person says that. No, I need you to go to jail. <laughs> <laughs> because the mental health thing can only stretch for so far. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> this is why I say that. Because when Agatha was like, "Look." You don't know what you're doing. You're a child with a bazooka. You have powers that you don't understand. Let me take them for, from you. Because so, I know what to do with them. As a matter of fact, you're prophesized as the destruction of the fucking world. Let me show you. And she shows the chains that this bitch had around all these people's necks. Well, those only came when she, uh, Agatha let their minds out. Yeah. And then they all started bombarding her, and then she got overwhelmed, and then those things happened. So that then, was no. And, there's no and, excuse for and slavery. Then, and then, yeah. and then, um, those Wanda people. put them back in in their chains, and then Agatha had the best line of the series for me. That's not what heroes do, and that's the shit I've been trying to get at for the longest. She basically Every, everyone wants to bitch it. Hayward is mean because he yelled at it loudly. <laughs> Maybe falsify some evidence. Maybe. For, for, <laughs> maybe. So like, for like, so, so, okay, for people that don't even map. Wait, first wait, of all, wait. the false, let's get the falsifying evidence shit out the window. I have a question. Uh huh. So, she has sword a only right. goes toward you know space shit, right? No, we don't know that. Is it that usually? They the, change. It, they change. It, it, they change but it in the beginning, come, but in the beginning of the show, when we first see him, didn't they say out to space shit? We don't know. And then they. He said that they stopped doing space shit. Said we don't. No, we he grounded the people that were blipped. And he that said, doesn't mean they stopped doing space shit. He said that we're doing. We're not doing space shit anymore. We're doing sentient weapon shit. That's what he said. Yeah, because because the, the first two letters in sword is for the MCU is sentient weapon. Okay. So all they and 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 that's why I don't understand why people are so mad at Hayward using the thing that he has. No. It's because harder. he didn't know how to make it work, and he'd been trying yeah. to make it work. That's and the then, point of thought. What's the point of observation so and <laughs> So what you're saying is, so what, so what you're so saying he is went what to you're Wanda, saying. antagonized Wanda, attacked Wanda I'm to sorry, get that I'm weapon. Sorry, I'm sorry. Wait, 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 w
Everybody, everybody breathe. <laughs> everybody breathe. We're gonna take this one person at a time. Sid, you up back first. Alright, first of all, let me bring that back. Hold on. <laughs> okay. So he did not antagonize Wanda. He didn't. Wanda kidnapped the town. And he tried Wait, several he, he tried <laughs> several times to communicate with her. When? Yes, he did. When was the first time? How about the first time no. when she barged into Thor headquarters? <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm talking about no, after that. No, we're talking about we're talking about all after. Stop, 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 stop. Because you, I'll, I'll explain. Wait. When she put the hex up, they sent a drone in there. She destroyed the no, drone. No, they sent Monica first because that was to get her out of the Actually, way. Actually, no, they sent the Monica first. Oh, okay. no, 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 no. Okay, okay, cool. They sent Monica because Mon Monica still plays into my shit. Monica they fell in there first of all. Yeah, okay, Monica, so Monica fell in there, and then they only started going in and then realized what because they were like because, because they were like we need to retrieve they, our agent. But they didn't know it was Wanda until Monica went in there, and then they brought everybody else. Yes, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. They just said missing person no okay first of all they knew my they knew it was wanda after they sent the drone in to Which see what was, was going after on we saw monica going okay past. okay the order of when this shit happened doesn't matter <laughs> the it point does is, because they had a missing agent and no, that's why they sent the drone me, in to find let them. me let me tell you why it doesn't matter so then they send the drone in <laughs> and she's super aggressive with the drone she mm -hmm. destroyed the drone then she didn't they, destroy the drone. Well, yes, she did because mm, it was intruded. She <laughs> threw the drone yeah, out. It's, 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 she it's, she it's, threw it's, the drone out. Yeah, oh, okay. okay. So yes, obviously she's made this world. I'm not saying that she hasn't, but the whole reason Haywood went in there you mean, was. Uh, hold on, hold on. I'm <laughs> fucking speak, please. <laughs> okay. I'm chill. So after. <laughs> go, go ahead. So after they put the drone in. <laughs> <laughs> they sent Monica in, they sent the drone in, they tried to contact her through the radio and she turned the radio off. Then they sent the beekeeper in and God knows where, where he is. Where can, can, can I speak? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so it was Jimmy and Darcy trying mm -hmm. to communicate with one. Who do they work for? Jimmy works for the FBI. I don't in know that if you were watching the same show. In, in, that, that, moment, who in they? that moment, they were under sword. 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 Yeah. In that moment, they were under sword. Okay. I'm not saying that. that but counts. Hayward did not try to contact Wanda. The first contact we saw him initiate so with Wanda was when he was firing a fucking missile at her. Just because Hayward oh, doesn't directly... He got to speak to her directly? Like the first he contact hired the, he initiated. He hired her. He, no, no, he the con yes, the con No, 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 no. The only he tried everything he could to get. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Listen, 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 listen. Because mind you, wait, 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 w
and she was nonviolent. So and nonviolent, was, right? And, wait, 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 wait. Who, let, who, who, let me finish. And so wait, what, when Hayley was And then who chose Wait, who chose I'm in the middle of something. Who chose Hayley? Hayley, she's been defiant. No, 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 no. Who got no. sent through three buildings? <laughs> she got sent out because obviously Monica was a spy. Oh, gosh. Jesus. <laughs> let me finish. Let me, please let me finish. Finish. So she was like, look. I fought through this. I want to let you know that you are doing this. That you are actively doing this to people. In which Wanda snapped out of it and was like, you don't belong here. Which means she was clearly aware of what was going on and what she was doing. And she she physically threw her through four dimensions out of this box. <laughs> now, when I take the agent and throw their body to be lifeless on the outside of a dome, I don't know what you okay. did to her. Now, we saw that, but if you remember with the show, they cut that part out. So all they saw was that it cut, and then it, uh, it went to the ending credits, and then they saw Monica coming out. And Monica debriefed them. Yes, Monica debriefed them, but she also said, let's approach this non-violently. We can't fire a missile at her. We will not win this fight. What's your point? So what should Hayward have done? Not approached it with violence! Every care about so, the fucking so here's the team. Thing, so here's the thing. And here's, you had a, here's, here's the problem with your answer. You didn't give an answer. Everyone, so literally, everyone approached Wanda with nonviolence besides Hayward. Everyone did. And so Hay did. Monica did. I, Agnes did. And, um, and even yes, before Agnes, Agnes did. Agnes, Agnes approached her nonviolently. So even before that, in the Thor headquarters, he was cordial with her. And he okay. he was cordial and but firm and told her we have legal rights to his body. But she so was the only right. one acting out because she, she went right. up in there and started and breaking right. shit. If she if she, she had broke a, the glass. Yeah. Why would you do that? Do you just go in well, other no, people's no, shit not, and not break shit? Not. As we can see, this show <laughs> many many problems. <laughs> and it honestly <laughs> one of one of which is they sped through this last episode. Granted, it was longer than the other episodes, but whatever. Um, yeah, some things were wrapped up and theories were not paid off or whatever. That wasn't really the disappointment for me. Disappointment for me. It was that we can tell they rushed through this ending. So I'm gonna say this: it's not even that they rushed through this ending. Like the narrative overall is sloppy. It's it's why we and and here's the thing. Once again, I have to put this out here: we were not attacking you, but our problems with when we've had <coughs> conversations about this show and the ending in particular is that when we ask what should have Hay what Hayward should have done instead of what he did do, no one has an answer outside of call the Avengers. And the thing is, one, there are no Avengers. They don't exist. They broke up. Two, the only people that were around can't do anything to defend themselves against Wanda if she were to nut up if they talked to her. Three, Sword is a military is a military unit. They have to be able to handle that stuff on their own without calling anybody. And four, the most important one of all, if because one of the other things they say is well, he should have just called Doctor Strange. For one thing, he doesn't have his motherfucking number. Why would he have that, A? B, if Agatha could sense that Wanda was acting up and came right over there, Doctor Strange should have been able to do the same thing being the Sorcerer <laughs> Supreme. Why should they have to get on the phone and call him? I will say this. Um, there's nothing that Hayward did that General Ross, General Ross wouldn't have done. That's all I'm saying. Or Nick Fury, for that mm-hmm. We we've seen Nick Fury has has harvested hydro weapons in advance to try to fight people. So they were trying to find the best way to deal with these with situations before they became threats. Exactly. And remember in Captain America Civil War where um not Civil War but in Winter Captain Soldier. America Winter Soldier where Captain America was like shut this shit down, shut shield down. And Nick Fury was like, okay. And then Avengers Age of Ultron comes up and he's like, got my shield shit, let's go. And you know, Captain America wasn't like her room, but like I was in the theater, like, God damn, you was told to put this shit up. <laughs> <laughs> and 
real, I'm real glad you ignored order. <laughs> the point we're trying to get at is Hayward is damned if he do and damned if he don't. Well, I, I just want to say this piece. There was thousand. There was a couple of hundred hostages in that town, mm -hmm. and when you got that many people under threat of somebody who can kill them with literally the stop of their fingers, it's like, what the hell do I do? But from what I saw. When they went in there and they saw the door opening, they weren't like, okay, secure everybody, let's get them out of here. They were like, go straight for one well, send the vision in so he can attack the other vision. Because we don't know how, they don't know how long that barrier was going to be down. But it was open, so they should have had people trying to like, mind collect you, everybody. Mind you, they have to drive all the way to the middle of the city. Who's mind you, she expanded her range for extra miles. Mm -hmm. So now they got to haul ass to okay. the middle of the city. And mind you, they, they were missing people because some of their people got trapped in there. To begin mm -hmm. with, so they were okay, already short, but short man. Everybody was now clearer now, right? So, because so it was everyone's like, been right, released. Was, so it's like so okay, let's you, get to so this. those sort of agents that were already in there should have been like, okay, we because they all their stuff. Well, no, that was after she retracted everything, but they were awake now, so they were like, okay, get out, get some more stuff, and then go back in, right? They took the little bit of sword agents they had. Went to go find where the threat was located. It was probably the center of town or whatever. Is it a little bit, or did they get more people after that? They didn't have, sure they they didn't have more people. And, and like, and I know you don't like this, but like that was the tactical thing to do to attack the threat that was there. But right. if you're, because Ken just said, you know, they have how many odd hostages. So why wouldn't you secure the hostages? You don't because know how they, many. exactly. But you one. secure all that you can. Yeah, right? And you're pulling your manpower away that you would need to fight a threat. So just fight the threat and yes. fuck everybody yes. else. Yes, yes. Because my thing is... <laughs> so you can't use the hostages if you just like, what's the hostages? Because my thing is this. What if in all the time you spend trying to get hostages out, she reenacts the barrier and now all y'all stuck in there? So why would you say... Okay, because so you're like... So she's... neutralize Wanda. That's what your, that's but, what your objective okay. is. No, no, no. Go ahead and say what you're about to say. If if a bomb is about to go off, you don't you yeah you can get people to send everybody away, but let's go deactivate that bomb. Okay, <laughs> but the whole for me the whole reason was you see one that's preoccupied with Agatha. They don't know who, don't that, know is. who that is. They don't know who it is, but you see that they're fighting each other. Maybe so one that's preoccupied with this. Purple lady, no, yes. they, when they you lit sent your vision after her imaginary vision. No, 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 they sent vision after her, first of all. No, they sent him after the vision. No, he literally didn't. said, I'm supposed to kill the vision. And Wanda. The first so person he, he was attacked, first person he attacked was Wanda. And which he no, almost... No, he was... Yeah, okay, so that was the first one he came in contact with, but then vision came. Yeah. So then he was preoccupied with vision okay. and Wanda was preoccupied with Agatha. Right. When the military showed up, all they saw were two floating chicks. And Fighting they, each other. No, no, they didn't because Agatha was just, just sitting there and she was hovering and the military literally got out of the car and was like, a uh, chick is hovering. Ugh. And then she took them and froze them and picked them up and dropped them. And Wanda was Agatha like... Agatha dropped them and Wanda... I know. Yeah. And then Wanda was like, well, I'm going to be a good guy in this instance. <laughs> <laughs> and save them because this is going to make up for everything. <laughs> but, I mean, in general, this is why he was justified for making White Vision. Because this is the shit I was talking about. This, this, this is... Sword so, so stands for sentient weapon... Observation and response division. When they were working on vision, that was the observation part. They and had the to, and the response part is send white vision in and maybe we'll send some guys in too to help. Like, like, like the only people who knew how vision worked was fucking vision and Tony Stark and Bruce Banner. And one is maybe, dead. Maybe, maybe Siri. Who? Siri. Okay. Siri. Yeah, Siri. Yeah, Siri. I call and, Siri. <laughs> and one is dead and the other has a bum arm and apparently that that that's all it takes for him and, to just fucking quit. And all so, so they had to they they had to take them apart. And also, you got to see it from the perspective of of Hayward and Thor because I don't know if you remember this, but five years ago the Avengers fought Thanos and got their asses beat, and they was and they were their only defense. They were their only defense. Spider Man couldn't beat fucking Thanos. There was no shield, by the way. No shield. 
nothing. Winter Soldier got clapped. <laughs> so, 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 like, so now everybody who was in Wakanda got clapped. So now you in the middle of butt fuck America. And your magical white man got fucked up. He just gave up on in outer space. So so now you in the middle of butt fuck America where she's literally taking over a town and you like there's all those hostages in there. There's an agent we can't find. There's people that we're seeing on a... There's, we don't know what's going on. We just know the shit's going ham. And then we go in there and find out that the strongest, one of the strongest Avengers has flipped her shit. And now we got to figure out how to get them away before she... What, cause what, and, what, and that goes back to my question. What were they supposed to do? My thing is, if you know that it's one of the strongest Avengers and you don't mm -hmm. exactly understand mm -hmm. everything that's going on, mm -hmm. don't shoot a fucking missile at her. Okay, okay. but my thing that, that, They tried every other option. That, that, <laughs> did, okay. Question, question. Wait, wait, wait. What, 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 what if they would have shot that missile and killed Wanda? And then everything would be cool. Would you? Would we be, would we be okay with that? But my thing is, if you know she's one of the strongest Avengers and you're not exactly sure of her power set, don't risk it like that. That's just me. So, how what, many is your, times, so what is your other strategy? How what? many times do they talk to her until... until so they here, I'm going to stop you right there because I think we're way past the how many times Hayward did this and that and whatnot. My question is, okay, we don't fire on her. What is the alternative? That's not that's not my area of expertise. Oh, you don't have an answer. I'm just saying, <laughs> the it doesn't seem like the fucking. Okay. We're, right. America, we're America. We're okay. America. We don't negotiate. You with shoot things. <laughs> All right, moving on. <laughs> but so, that, as, you, as you can see, this was a very divisive episode. <laughs> <laughs> Fear <sure>. Reeve. <laughs> series. Uh, well, has, I, I, I will say overall. It has so a, a, overall. Yeah. It was a decent series for so, what they for what they did. So here's the there thing. Were, oh, sorry. Go ahead. Go 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 go. Because there are holes that I'm still kind of confused about. Like who was the missing person? Jimmy was. Don't worry about. Don't matter. <laughs> who was the missing person? I told you three episodes ago. Didn't I? <laughs> no, <laughs> that's but that was that. That, 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 that was something a, they should have brought up. It's a Chekhov gun, and they didn't fire that shit. And, and, and they the really and, should have. And, and the hilarious part about that is. The uh, the very episode where you was like, don't worry about it. They bring him up the next episode. So you had a reason to wonder who the fuck that guy was. Almost like and you then, had a reason to wonder who the engineer was because they brought him up a couple times. And they uh, kept saying, he, 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 he. And then a woman comes out. And I'm like, who is you? <laughs> but they didn't even mention that she was the aerospace engineer, right? I don't, 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 was care. It actually I don't, know. don't care. By the way, I'm also glad that you guys showed the extended cut where Wanda doesn't learn her lesson. And <laughs> <laughs> kind of like the Quicksilver shit, like nobody cares. It's just padding. Um, and but but that's the, so. Here's the thing: you sold that series on the fact that we're doing crossover because X Men come in, and you nobody. wanted to make a dick joke. And it's like if you just wanted Wanda, if you just wanted Wanda or Monica to say erect penis, just have them say erect penis. As you can see, the shit. Because his name was Ralph. His, Ray, yeah. his name was Ralph Boner, and I'm like, that could have been the fucking the the missing um, person. Missing that's, person. That's, that's who I thought he was. But but so, so now my, I'm just like, so what? Agatha just picked him and just made the charm. She was like, I like this house. It's the one of the house. Or did he already have the superpowers? And she no, the charm gave him the superpowers. That's what I thought. It, he just he just lived next door. She was like, I need to be close to Wanda. Give me this shit. But <laughs> but in addition to all of that, what makes that worth is um fuck never mind. As you guys can see, this has been a very um. Hard season to watch. Uh, they they tried to they, they tried to present something, and they turned it into something else that eventually fell on its face. There were some good things that we saw in this series, as we explained in our past episodes, and some things were just why would you even do this? But as we can see that this we can look forward to other uh, shows like maybe the Falcon and Winter Soldier that's coming in two weeks. But that's anyway, not Loki. thank you for guys. <laughs> thank you guys for joining us for this episode of the Just Us Review. Where we take our favorite shows, break them down, and give you the truth behind the curtains. Like and subscribe, but until next time, Hayward did nothing wrong. <laughs> so, that was supposed to be this Ralph character that Agnes kept talking about throughout the series. That right. was her husband. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah sorry. It didn't, even, it didn't even click. I know, it, oh. because it's just...
episode structure. And quick thing, the reason why I don't think he was the um, missing person, uh, well, correct me if I'm wrong, was the missing person supposed to be in witness protection? Yes. Yeah. Okay. The missing person was in witness protection, and that's why, because Ralph Bona seems like a completely made up name. But he so, was an actor, and that was on his. He he, he had, had he had a, he, uh, he had a he had head they, they wanted to they wanted to make a a dick and, joke, and, and if I'm you like, were just have Monica say erect penis, and if like, you were um because that's what you wanted her to do. If you were if you were in witness protection, why would you be trying to be an actor? Right. That means you're trying to be in front of trying to no. So I was, so they the the creator said that they this wasn't the original ending that. Basically, they wanted to do more stuff, but time and COVID everybody. Everybody and says that with a show called Slap. This is not original design. Well, they said that they wanted. Yeah. They, they said they wanted. Could have uh, worn a shirt. They said they wanted Monica, wore shirt. Darcy, and Wu to investigate the basement and Could've find out shirt. that the rabbit was a demon or some shit. Could have worn a shirt. Yeah, apparently there was a scene <laughs> where the kids try to go down with the rabbit in the basement, and then the rabbit tries to attack them or something. Hey guys, yeah. guess what? I've heard Cut that they were changing shit, shit based I'll on be the know. audience reaction. Cut 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 I, don't, I didn't need anything with the rabbit. <laughs> yeah, my thing is this. I don't care what you was meaning to make for dinner. If it ain't on the plate, I ain't eating it. But I mean, at the same time, you got to look at it in the, in the lens of COVID in, in some sense. Because one, didn't you say this, this show premiered out of order? Yes. This, this, this show was supposed, supposed to be like the last show. So the aerospace engineer that we were supposed to see in this one should have been, could have, like, been, could have been in either Loki Who knows? or the Falcon and the Winter Soldier. Or could have I been in know. this show. Who knows? Maybe we were going to get Reed Richards. Who knows? Darcy, Darcy, was gonna be Darcy wasn't in the last episode because they stopped filming. She <laughs> was in the last episode. For she, like two she, seconds. Yeah, one she, scene. <laughs> <laughs> and for all we know, they went and shot that. They were like, come on, Darcy, come on over to the green screen. So we can she was literally play. there to plant drugs in Hayward's car. So that's, <laughs> like, that's the only thing you can get them on. It was so unbelievable that she got out of that car with the airbags <laughs> and <it was> rough, <laughs> and, and with such quickness. <laughs> You're not caring, right? I mean, I was doing that. I was cutting a lot of it out. Please. Anyway. But um, I also feel like, look, with with more time, they probably would have given more justifiable reasons for why Hayward. Mm-hmm. It wishes but we were supposed to get like nuts. Black Widow first, right? Yeah, okay. supposed to get mm-hmm. Black Widow last year. Supposed to get Internals last year. It, it, I don't know what I don't know what Disney Plus show was supposed to be first. Falcon and Winter Soldier was supposed to be. Okay, okay so that was the palette. Yeah, mm-hmm. that was the first uh, trailer. So I, I have no, I actually have no hope for Falcon and Winter Soldier now. Um, I think the best thing that came out was a new outfit. Pretty much it. Cause like, cause like my friend was like, I told him like three episodes ago there was really nothing more that the show could offer. And he was like. He's, he's like, you know, I'm not the deep comic book fan or whatever, but I'm like in every episode and I feel like it was more stuff. We pretty much figured out everything three episodes ago and mm-hmm. I was like, it's not giving me anything. Yeah, and here's the thing, like, this gonna sound fucked up because I was slamming people for it and shit like that, but it would have made more sense if Hayward was on the fifth though. <laughs> like, and, like everybody was with this stuff. Yeah, <laughs> like that would have made the most sense. Will anybody watch this series again? No, I'm gonna, I'm be, gonna watch it one yeah. more time because I'm gonna binge it straight through. I'm gonna be a hundred percent out of what you. I probably will, if only only because my mom wants to watch it. Right, but I would probably I'm, only from like episode three though. Yeah, I was just gonna say that. If I'm being honest with you, oh, one, one, watch episode one, or two. one of y'all was watching was watching one of the earlier episodes in here, mm-hmm. and I wanted to sit there and watch it, but I was like, I can't do that again. It was probably episode three, but um. Even the creator said we probably should have released all three episodes at one time instead mm-hmm. of the first two. Mm-hmm. All these would have, should have, could have. Yeah, all like, yeah, yeah. Like you knew it fell flat. You should have just do some X Men. At there. the end of the day, they're trying to say that this was just it's supposed to be a small story, like Wanda's story. But at the same time, it's like the day, you the can't do that. You can't do that in a universe of superheroes, and then it's like, all right, cop, car, chill, guys. It's just one person story. Mm-hmm. Calm down, mm-hmm. be cool. And if you're gonna, you can't just <laughs> enslave a group of people and be like, okay, guys, forget about it. But but also, if you're going to do that, 
like don't play on people's expectations that more heroes will come. Right. They, 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 I mean, I don't care what anybody says. They played on the fact that Quicksilver, that Evan Peters was Quicksilver. Who they, said that? Uh, they played on the fact that that engineer was probably someone from the Marvel universe that we hadn't been introduced to yet. Like they, they played, they played a lot of people. Who, who was the one who said that we were gonna have a Luke Skywalker like cameo? Who, like, who, who Elizabeth, Elizabeth Olsen did an interview with some woman from a news outlet. And the woman asked her, was there going to be a Luke Skywalker-like cameo? And she said yes. And the thing is, that interview probably happened earlier, but it came out after Evan Peters showed up. Mm -hmm. So people was like, oh, there's gonna be another cameo. Right. And then to fan the flame, and he did he was he did this on purpose. To fan the flames even more, then Paul Bettany strolled his ass up on, on stage and was like, I'm gonna be acting with someone that I've always wanted to act with my entire life right. and then later came out and said it was me guys it was me, it was me all along me all along we did get a uh, dope ass trap song out of this out of series mm -hmm. i'll be banging that one um did did, did, did 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 <laughs> we also got like a good villain too. Like I don't care what y'all say, putting kids on leashes is a, 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 a badass oh, villain movie. Villain? What? Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Hero. Hero. Exactly. We got a bomb ass hero. <laughs> as far as I'm concerned, y'all have ever been to like I don't know, like Six Flags or New Orleans or whatever, and see them things, the the invisible dog collars. As yeah. far as I'm concerned, that's what Agatha did. <laughs> She's like, I'm holding something. <laughs> I can't quite see them. Uh, maybe I can hear something. <laughs> you see something down there, that's, Wanda? That's literally all that was, as far as I'm concerned. Come get your keys. <laughs> Crazy bitch. She's got that fucking <laughs> imagination. <laughs> but yeah, we, we also got the dark hole in there, and Wanda's reading the book. You, you said that, right? Yeah. She's reading the book. She didn't learn nothing. She learned nothing. Well, she learned about the runes, and I also I forgot no, to mention No, the this. lesson is don't be fucking with shit you don't know. <laughs> I have a question. I have a question. How did she learn about runes? Uh, Agatha told her about the runes, and so she saw the runes, and she just copied them outside. Wouldn't the runes be specific to the witch? It says runes in this given space. She said that's basic witch knowledge, so I guess it's not specific. Because so in re any given space, she only the witch it. that cast it. So she just, she just re recreated the she room. Copied she copied and pasted a room. Mm -hmm. How? How? She, <laughs> she saw the room, so she magic. just she oh, used yeah. the magic. She didn't see them all. Yeah. She didn't see them all, though. But she saw them in I the mean, room. She was suspended in the air, so I imagine she was looking she around. Didn't know. She didn't know. Here's the thing. If Wanda, if Wanda could make uh, purely detailed children, then she can make some fucking room. It's that walk and was, talk and eat. It was eat almost eat. like she just told her, "Hey, if you make rooms, they can you can control the space." All right, rooms. Yeah. Wait, how did you know how to do that? Because my magic is on autopilot. Well, they <laughs> technically, it is her space. The hexagon is her space, so she yeah. just put rooms on the wall. So. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, when the space started disappearing, why can't Monica just leave? It's on um, Agatha. Agatha. Because that was a different. Agatha. That was a different spell. Because once you cast a spell, you can't alter the spell. Mm -hmm. So she already started to bring everything in and then cast a different spell on Agatha. She only cast one other spell on Agatha to um, turn her into the neighbor. Yes, but I'm saying when she let go of the other spell. Yeah, the original spell she put on was dispelled. She dispelled the room shit because the Because that I'm, I'm just talking about timeline-wise. She dispelled everything else and then... She was like, and yeah, but Agatha wasn't out of magic. Was she? No, I thought she absorbed her magic. She didn't take all her magic. Otherwise, she would have been decrepit. No, too. the thing is, I thought that Wanaka was kind of like Wanda playing took some of her possum. Magic. Yeah, she took some of her magic, but she didn't take it all. Yeah, she take it all. Yeah, that's why I'm like when the but rules went away. But then at the same time, Agatha was like, okay, what the fuck do I do? Mm -hmm. Bam. <laughs> <laughs> the sure. thing is, like Agatha couldn't change Wanda's. Spell. So Ralph was already under, you know, his little mind shit. But Agatha just put the chain on him so that he would be her brother. Mm -hmm. 
and that's why I think like she could only like alter minor things and couldn't like dispel the whole thing and just stop one day in her track say, listen, you're doing it all wrong, let me show you. No, I'm just, you no, I'm just wondering why she just didn't escape once the rooms were gone. Because she still had power. Yeah, but didn't mm-hmm. Wanda beat her ass as well? Kinda. Don't mean I can't use my powers to get the fuck out. She was just yeah, Wanda needs her later in the future, so yeah, whatever. Yeah. Hey, she's gonna I fucked her up like you said I was. Like she's gonna be like, I only know one person who knows. Go back shit. to her plantation. <laughs> go back to her plantation and free her slave. <laughs> it was like the oh. <laughs> she lived like a little picking cotton and shit. <laughs> Howdy ho, neighbor. Howdy ho, neighbor. I swear to God, if next time we see her and she's like picking up some type of plant or flower or whatever, I'm going to like remember this. <laughs> Lucid. <laughs> but yeah. Um, yeah. All right. So this just tampers my expectation for every other Marvel show. I actually think Falcon and Winter Soldier is going to be better because it's going to be more Because they had more time. Yeah. More action focused too. They they were stopped during COVID, but the only reason that was is because they had to film shit around the world. So my question is, what is Falcon and the Winter Soldier gonna lead to? Nothing. I mean, that, that's not necessarily that true. That dude with the the sock on his head that he put eye holes Zima. out. Of, I don't Zima. know who the fuck it was. He just <laughs> put <laughs> eye holes out of a sock. That's that's the sole that's of That's pretty much. Look, nobody said it when Kick Ass did it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Completely different side note. I'm not watching King Kong versus Godzilla. First of all, I'm I'm for the front row. I'm on, I'm on I, I, I was until I saw him bundle with a kid, and I was like, <laughs> she, he's the only one she'll speak to. Why? Why does it, Why does a person always have to be a viral? I had to watch. Always, you know they, they always, always put kids in the like, Yeah, and we, we fell in love with a white girl, and I'm like, <laughs> no, no, Kong Skull Island. Oh, uh, which one is that one? This was that the, was the, the one with Brie Larson. Yeah, he fell in love with a white girl. No, he no. didn't. Brie Larson. He fell in love with Brie Larson. That's the MCU no. with it. Brie Larson was in it. Sam Jackson was in it. He Loki fell in love with Brie Larson. Uh, yeah, he did. Uh, John was in it. I was high when I watched it. <laughs> he fell in love with Brie Larson. Then I watched the uh, Godzilla one, who was apparently best friends with Millie Bobby Brown for whatever fucking reason. And now we got... No, we was She never had any contact with <laughs> Yes, she did. No, yes, she, she didn't. Did. She, she lured. She spoke she, to Mothra and she spoke to Godzilla. She did not right? speak to Mothra. Yes, she did. When <laughs> I didn't in, watch these, but when, I don't know. <laughs> when, he, when he was inside the ice chasm and she was like, I can you hear the. <laughs> Because I started, I was like, get the fuck out of here.